All right, everybody, this is a special YouTube video because today is my dude Ted Stryker on X's birthday, and he wanted to go ahead and taste star fruit and milk, and we said we'd do it together, so happy birthday, bro, and here we go, man. We're going to do the star fruit tub. I've never tasted this in milk, so this will be a new one to me. Let's go ahead and get it mixed up, and of course, you know, I have to use the, uh, the butters cup because why wouldn't I? All right, so it's all shaken up and mixed properly. Now, I it, the color really didn't change. I kind of expected it to change a little bit more, but then again, milk is real thick, and it takes a lot for it to actually change the color real heavily. So, cheers, everyone. That's actually good. I'm not 100% sure. Like, I think Ted said, you know, uh, he said that it was like banana is what it tasted like, which I'm almost getting like maybe that artificial, like that banana, like that runs taste maybe or something. But as far as like an actual full blown banana shake, I don't really taste the banana. However, it almost makes me want to add like naranjita or something that has a good banana flavor. So, and that's actually solid though. If anybody has not tried this in milk, I definitely would recommend at least trying it. It's definitely not bad at all. Um, it's a super solid flavor in milk. It's a flavor that I've reviewed in water, but a lot of flavors like this, I'm probably going to eventually experiment and explore with milk. Why not? So. Until next time, everybody, this has been your boy, King Mo. Much love, Ted, and happy birthday, bro. I hope you're like 28, 27, 29, 42. I know that I, nobody really knows, so until next time. Peace, much love, take care.